in life, there are going to be situations and there are going to be people that catch you off guard. But it is our mandate, even when we're taken off guard, to love and keep pressing forward. So my challenge for you on today is no matter what comes your way, I want you to love your brothers and your sisters and keep pressing forward. And remember what Isaiah says, when the enemy comes in like a flood, the spirit of the Lord will lift up a standard against him. May we pray. Gracious Heavenly Father, we come now as humbly as we know how, thanking you for this another day that you have bestowed upon us. It is our prayer, Lord, that you guide us on today and show us the way in which we need to go. We ask you, Lord, to forgive us of our sins as we strive to be in your presence and move in your presence and glean from your presence. We ask you, Lord, to guide our churches. We ask you to give us a heart and a mind to serve you the way you want us to serve you. We ask you to give us Holy Ghost boldness as we go out into the land of the shadow of death. Give us a heart to teach and live the truth about you, to preach and live the gospel, and to be a healing vessel in times of darkness. We ask you, Lord, to bless our children as they go forth on today. We ask you to be a hedge of protection around them, Lord. We ask you to bless those who are sick. We ask you to bless those who are dealing with trouble and struggle. And we ask you, Lord, to simply be a healing balm in this land. We ask you to bless the world. There's trouble going on in the world, Lord God, and we ask you to work it out according to your will and to your in according to your way. We ask you, Lord, to protect us, Lord, in this time of war. We ask you to give us focus and give us wisdom and knowledge to deal with the situations that come our way. So right now, Lord, as we prepare ourselves to go forth on today, we ask you to renew our hearts, to renew our minds, and give us a mindset to be focused on you and to be loving vessels for your glory, Lord. So be with us now as we boldly go forth into a day in which we have never seen before. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory. Forever we pray, amen. God bless you and make today the best day of your life, knowing that tomorrow is going to be even better. God bless you.